Donald Sutherland can't contain Sylvester Stallone. Lock up. When Sylvester Stallone gets abducted in the middle of the night, he is taken to a new prison in revenge for escaping before. 120 men and four women were electrocuted in that chair before it was retired. Beautiful, isn't it? When I came to Gateway, it was falling apart, so I had it restored, put back into perfect working order to remind me of how things ought to be. Where guards abuse him, along with some prisoners, while other prisoners befriend him. DTA. DTA, okay. <laughs> What's that, man? Don't trust anybody. Words you survive by. Watch your feet. Oh, yeah. DTA. And start building a car together, which an inmate gets carried away about. One favor, man. I appreciate the drive and everything, you know, but none of this is real unless I could hear this engine kick over just once. First, you know, if I turn the engine on, what's going to happen? These guys are going to bust it in here. They're going to grab up every one of us. They're going to throw us in the hole forever. Forget it. Only for the car to be destroyed and Stallone sent to solitary confinement. Every hour when the light comes on, you'll stand, face the camera, and state your name and number. <laughs> name and number. The only 510. Face the camera. Name and number. Then a prisoner kills one of his friends, which he decides not to avenge, only to be threatened by another prisoner. I got a job lined up when I get out. It's just temporary, you know, but it pays about a grand for two hours' work. It's not bad, is it? What do you gotta do? I just gotta rape this bitch. I get an extra hundred every time she screams. Prompting another escape attempt, which is a setup that backfires, giving him another chance to escape. DTA, Frank. Is that what you taught me, man? DTA. Right on schedule, Frank. No, I'm sorry, man. You were my ticket out of here. I'm sorry and strapped Sutherland to an electric chair to coerce a confession from him. It's true. I confess. I confess, Mr. Meisner, everything that he said was true. I set him up. Everything. Worth watching for Frank McRae. Fuck up. Get over on that other team. That's who you're playing for anyway. The only thing you brought here is trouble. Come on, Eclipse. You know, I heard all about you, Leone. And whatever's between you and Drumgold ain't coming in here. As you can see, the Bulls ain't got no problem with me, and I ain't got no problem with the Bulls. But if you still are. Looks like you need the help, and I need the exercise. So call a play. You still interested in the job? Yeah, yeah. Help train, son. Help train. I can see why they call you Eclipse. What are you, about six, seven? Yeah, I do block a lot of sun, don't I? <laughs> that you do. I had a guy on the outside who used to get me good Havanas. Uh-huh. Not this crap. But someday. Don't lay down on me now. Come on. 